Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Pravin Kumar Vumasethi. Today we'll see one of the top 15 basic Snowflake entry questions. Okay, as a part of Snowflake developer, you should know, must and should know these basic questions. Okay, these are important. Okay, we'll use regularly. So first question is that what, okay, how to see my database? If you are working for multiple database, I want to see what is my database. Go for select current database. Okay, so in re remember in real time, we'll have development database, testing, UAT, prod. Okay, so if you want to figure out what is the database you're working go for select current database in a similar fashion we should know how to see my schema that is select current schema current database current schema in a similar fashion next question is that one how to see list of tables in the particular database i want to see list of tables you should go for what we should go from show tables by using this command we can able to see list of tables in a similar fashion next question is that what how to see list of columns in a table in a table i want to find what the columns are there we can go for describe table the table name so describe the table table you should get the table like okay customer details order details the table name we should put okay okay next question is that what okay how to list of how to see list of columns okay see show tables in a similar fashion show columns it will go in a particular table if i want to go for you go for describe table table name if i want to see all the columns will go for show columns next question is that what okay how to see detail script of a table okay i want to see definition or that create statement of a table that is select a get ddl table the table name so one more time i want the ddl that is create statements in text so get ddl the table table name we should pass here in a similar fashion next question is that what how to find the version so see, we can able to figure out by using select current version. This is one of the important question asking the issues. Current version. Next question, how to find the edition? Okay, we are having standard edition, enterprise edition, business critical, virtual private snowflake. There are four editions are there. So out of this, which edition we are working? We can able to figure out by using show organization accounts. By using this command, we can able to get show organization accounts. Okay, by this we can able to figure out what is my edition we are using. Next question is that what? Okay, how to find the cloud? Okay, so which cloud? Let's remember Snowflake supports multi clouds. It can support AWS, that is Azure, Amazon Web Services, Microsoft Azure, and GCP. In the current project, I want to figure out which cloud I'm using. We'll go for selecting current region. By this, we can able to figure out what is the cloud we are working. Next question is that what? How to find the user? Okay, there will be multiple users. I want to find my username. We'll go for select current user. Okay, current user, current database, current schema, current user, all the things we can able to figure. Next question, I want to find there are multiple roles. Okay, developer role, test role, we can go for what? So select current role. By this, we can able to figure out what is the role, current role. Next question is that what? Okay, warehouse. In a similar fashion, I want to find what is the warehouse we are using. We'll go for select current warehouse so remember anything now we'll go for current okay we're working database current database schema current schema current user current role current. so these are the basic thing you should know okay as a part of snowflake developer we should understand all the things okay these are very, very important our next question is that what same thing i want to get today's date okay we should go for current date by using current date we can able to figure out what's the today's date same thing i want to find what is the current time that is current time we'll go for current select current date as well as current time so next question is that what i want to figure out the date and as well as time stamp so current will give only date current will give only time but i want to figure out date and time we'll go for current time stamp current time stamp that will you date month milliseconds the time will give our next question is that what okay how to find current session so remember so current session you can go for select current session so there will be multiple sessions or the multiple windows or multiple sessions we are trying to open okay by this we can able to get select current session so remember so this current session is important in where in the transient uh, in the temporary table so temporary tables are session specific tables this this is very very important in the current session okay so go to the point so select current session there okay each session will have separate session id will be there go to the point okay if you like the content Subscribe and share the channel. Thank you for watching.